Good evening, and welcome back to another episode of Resident Evil 4 The Remake. is almost identical to the original. The boat fuel is stored with the generator fuel inside the processing building at the fish farm. Take only what you need. Okay, so the boat must be out of fuel. Come on, fill the tank when you're done. Yeah, so change this up again. Really good. But this was in the original. Different layout. Crossbow guys. God damn it. Well, at least he hasn't got a crossbow anymore. Oh. 
damn their shotgun is for fun to use. Over that. Just make sure there's no one behind me. Whoop. That was pretty uh, intense, but that ended. Not sure yet. This is what I'm talking about. Yep, got the boat fuel. Because you can wait your way back round. I just hope there's not a sudden. Influx of enemies here. Looks like we're okay. Now, I do want to try something, and if you've played Resident Evil 4, the original before, you probably know what I'm going to do. Oh, look! Just some nice fish to shoot. I wonder what will happen if I shoot the fish. A 
It did happen. Brilliant. Anyway, that was alternative universe. Back in the real world. Oh, you can see the castle in the background. Not looking good, Leon. Very similar. God, he looks good though, doesn't he? Looks like a big slimy. Yo, where's he gone? Yeah. Wait, where's he gone? Where's he gone? Come on. Oh no. Me whole, huh? Uh oh. Whew. Right, where are you? Didn't mean to do that. Um Come on. Where's he going? Where's he going? Oh, now he got hit into that boat. That's it. First time. And that was the end of the third chapter, so an hour and a half, 43 enemies killed. One death. Can't remember what that was. I know I did the fake death before where I got eaten by the monster, the sea monster, but I loaded after that, so I can't remember what that was. And about three quarters accuracy. Sacrificial lamb. You will receive our most sacred 
body begins now. When day breaks, you two will join our covenant to share in my holy blessing forever. I was going to say that Leon's got some uh, guns for arms on him in this version. Okay, so... Oh. Condor one to roost. Do you read me? Condor One? You've been radio silent for three hours. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. Won't let it happen again. And the church? I'm still looking for whatever key I need. Copy that. I'm glad you're okay. Roost out. Okay, so they'll definitely change this up. God, this is creepy. <laughs> The old trip of flashbangs and the guy with the, the guys with the extra heads. Right, okay, I should maybe should have. Do we use another flashbang? Gonna have to on that. Now I can make flashbangs. I'm not 100% sure what I need. Let's have a look. So I need five gunpowder and one of the larger resources. So I'll, I'll make one now. I think that's going to be worthwhile. Got some, sorry, small resources I think it was that I used for the flashbang. Is what it is. Some kind of shrine. The same mark from the church. It's the lake. Asa now on the lake when we get back to the boat looks like there's some decent uh, items that we could get old way shrine key right not sure what that's going to be for yet And we're on the lookout for gold chicken egg. Oh, so they've definitely changed it up. I was expecting to be facing some enemies there. Oh, we've still got the harpoon. That's a bit worrying.
Okay, got a bangle. Good stuff. So I'm glad I came here. So I'm just going to navigate all along these pathways. It's a little bit tricky with this boat. Maybe go a bit slower. As you can see, I'm picking up a fair amount of potatoes just by crashing into these barrels. So it's worth coming this way. Back out into the main lake. It's open. There's not going to be anything that comes out here, is there? Rifle ammo. Get the hexagonal piece. Yeah, I'm going to go up here to get the... To get this. from his head. Ooh, nice. Now I'm going to head into the middle. Let's start. Get one of those. Now. Is there anything around here? Let's uh, Is there going to be anything here worthwhile getting? Oxandrite, okay. Gunpowder. What's this? Oh, the Red Nine. Ah, oh, it's one of my all time favourite guns. Now, whether it'll be as good on this game, I don't know. I wonder if you can buy that without finding it. I've got it now anyway. Okay, I am heading back here to get to my good old friend is around here somewhere. Nice, more collectibles. And the reason I'm coming back is just to see if there's anything I can sell, I rearrange things, see how much money I've got. And I have just used two of the same types of treasures to inlay there because that's the biggest bonus you get with two. Interesting, so there are discounted items but they're only available at a discount in specific chapters. Interesting. Definitely buying the case All upgrade. My wares are in tip -top shape. A decent size. But size ain't everything. I think we'll get the recipe for the attachable mines, that sounds good. Remember that, mate. Okay, some interesting choices that we can buy in the shop. You could get an elegant mask. Again, you could just put some uh, jewels in that to make more money. Got a TMP stock, which would be amazing. High power scope, which we don't need at the moment because we don't have the rifle. Obviously, more jewels. Attach a case black. Increases the drop weight of resources. Interesting. And obviously, the laser sight we haven't got yet, or the Punisher. I think for now we're going to get the TMP stock because short term that's going to be well and long term it's going to be best. I think next time I might look to buy some of the, the jewels and the the mask to make some money. Resource drop I'm not too bothered about at the moment. Some money can't buy. 
So I am going to store the normal handgun, the SG-09R. And we're going to try using the Red 9 for now. What I'm thinking is, now that we've got the TMP stock, this can be our sort of go-to quick weapon. This is a lot heavier and high power, but it also is pretty slow firing. So I'm just keeping an eye out, there should be something on the left here. Ah, here we go. Lots of chickens. Can I keep an eye out for golden egg? There we go, golden chicken egg. That's uh, for one of our tasks for the merchant. And another little dock to uh, explore. This one looks pretty creepy. Oop, there we go. Depraved idol. Ah, okay, this is for back near the start of this area. Okay, so that's one piece there, so I need the other. Welcome. So we've got the golden egg, so I'm going to sell that now. Your valuables perfect. You're a real professional. Well look at you, mate. So just one thing I wanted to pick up on, which I hadn't noticed when I installed the game, is that with the pre-order bonus, you got certain things such as extra weapons, I think there was like possibly an extra charm, an extended treasure map which showed you treasure that you can only see with this map. And I hadn't realized that it hadn't been installed correctly on the game. What had happened, and you may want to check this if you're playing on the PS5 version, is when you go to install the PS5, all the add-ons automatically install, at least they did for me. They actually tried to install the PS4 versions, which obviously are not compatible. So it's took me a couple of chapters to realize, hang on a minute, where, where's all the, the pre-order bonus stuff? So this is what we've got. We've got a skull shaker. We have got the Sentinel-9 as well. Now, I don't think I'm going to use them in this run, at least not yet. I haven't compared them properly, but this is a handgun and this is a shotgun. It's got a really cool sort of reload function. I uh, saw it very briefly in a video. And also there were extra costumes unlocked, which um, I'll probably show you in either a later time or another playthrough. The treasure map now have got all of these expanded map treasures with the plus sign. So if you look at the map, you can see way back near the start in the village, there's a couple that I've missed there. There's some, I haven't been there yet ever. But yeah, there's, there's some scattered around, so I've missed. So there's a fair bit of money I can make from getting these. That's really handy. I'm going to increase the power for the red nine because I know that's going to be a handgun I'm going to be using a fair bit. We're starting to get an idea of your tastes, friend. I think I'll increase the rate of fire too. There you are, as you and the reload speed. See how that feels, mate. Fellow like yourself should notice the difference right away. And the TMP, because again, that's another weapon we'll be using a fair bit. Increase the power. This kind of work is about finesse, stranger. Little bit goes a long way. You'll see. Oh, it's locked. Nice. Oh, great. Here we go. Oh. Kill his own friend. Nice. Love it when they do that. 
They're not the smartest. Grenade time. They're dead now. Get my bolts back. Throw, isn't he? Well, let's hope miss first. In case we need to make a run for it. Sneaky, sneaky little shit. Cast loads of these head bloody flag us, guys. He's going to blow up. <laughs> For God's sake, there's more of them. So get some good treasures. Just got to keep an eye out for the map for those extra treasures as well. Make sure we don't miss any. Now we're going to have to go and do this puzzle, I think. Now just looking at the map, so that's the menu, there's an expanded treasure and we've got a yellow herb down here, so gotta make sure we get both of these. God damn it. Set them on fire and Maybe you want to throw another flame? You never know, might. These things in 
hits, isn't he? Oh no. You're serious. Another one. There's more of them, but I think they're not. Maybe not as powerful as in the original. <laughs> Say that. Maybe I just got lucky. And um, we've got the yellow herb. Nice silver token. That's used for the shooting range. Um, you get silver tokens, and then you can put them in the machine and unlock uh, what they're called, not trinkets. Uh, the little attachment things. What they're called. I can't remember what they're called now. So now we're going to go and put this second piece in the puzzle. Aha, church insignia. So this will be able to get us in the church to get Ashley now. Condor one to roost. I found the key to the church. Copy that. Now go get baby eagle. Right. No time to chat. I'm going in. Condor one out. So you can see now it's telling us to head back to the church. My one question was is this lakeside settlement here that's one i've already completed but there's lots of no, expanded treasures i might leave that for now and potentially go back later if we can Three, come on we can two, do this Not good. Got an S. Wasn't perfect, but I got an S. And from that, we're going to try these three silver tokens. See what we'll get. Zealot with Bogan. 20% Bolts Craft Bonus Frequency. Okay, let's try that. And we might as well attach it because we've only got the one so far anyway. So 20% bolts craft bonus. I'm assuming that just means that when you craft bolts, you get 20% more. That's, that's all I can think of. It's just a little bit of a sideshow for the main thing, which is I'm assuming the next bit is uh, what I think it's going to be. But yeah, anyone who's played the original. Yeah, I can hear the growling. Oh shit. Yeah. Shit. Exactly, Leon. Exactly. Ah. That's slightly different than the original. Jesus Christ. Oh god. And of course there's no quick time. Fence. I'm assuming. Damn, how are you supposed to run out the way of that? I do not know how you avoid this. I don't understand how you're supposed to... Worm 
Ah, uh, Leon, never change. So it's similar-ish to the original. I just don't know how the hell you avoid this guy. Oh, come on, where's my dog friend? Oh, wow. The pop, the lightning, the wolf howl. Hey, it's that dog. Yes. Go oh, on, doggy. Yes. This dog better survive. I keep calling dogs a wolf, really. Come on. Shit, I'm gonna run out of bullets here. No way I'm gonna avoid that. Come on, doggy, I need your help. I really do. Come on. Is that it? Could that be it? Yeah, let's do that. But first, we will pick up these goodies. Back to the church it is. Now, are there going to be more enemies in this bit? going to reload because if there are dogs here, which is what I was implying there, um, we're going to eat an egg as well. Which one offers the least? That one. Oh crap. Oh no. Oh, you're kidding me. Doggy, I'm not liking you at the moment. It's not gonna be the only one, is it? Okay, it might be the only one. It might be the only one. Now that's a fancy entrance. Ashley Graham. I'm here to help. Yes, Leon. Wait. There's more key, useful. There we go, extra treasure. You remember, keep che checking that map. I forgot to say, there's a handle right here. Honestly, been searching around for bloody ages, going underneath the church, going everywhere, didn't see the handle. So, pretty much the same puzzle that was in the original. 
So we're just going to have a play around with this because I'm not 100% sure how this is going to work. It's obviously going to be different than the original. Um, oh, it's not exact either. Okay, that looks about right. Oh, we did it. Well, a bit of trial and error. Got that. Ashley, you in there? Ashley. Ashley Graham, are you in here? <laughs> Just let me go. Listen. Easy with that. My name's Leon. I'm hearing the president's orders. And... That one will. <laughs> Certainly did. Hey, it's dangerous outside. You need to listen to me. What is that? Over there? Damn. The last lamps are escaping. Deliver unto them. Salvation. This seems like it's going to be tougher. And that's the end of that chapter. It did take me over an hour and a half to do it, but I think a lot of that time was spent in the shooting range, probably at least 20 minutes or so. And I think I got a bit lost in the church section there, so probably a good five, 10 minutes running around like a headless chicken. And that's another episode of Resident Evil 4, the remake done for today. If you can hit that like button, drop a comment down below and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date. Another episode will be out next Sunday, same time, same place. Join us for that one. Cheers.